Hello, and welcome to Dr. Campbell's Science Demo. Today we're going to be taking a look at regulation. Hello, my name is Dr. James Campbell, and today we're going to be looking at regulation. Regulation is the process whereby uh, ice will melt when pressure is applied to it, and when the pressure is relieved, the water will again refreeze to form, form the ice again. It was discovered by Michael Faraday, uh, who noticed that if you take uh, two blocks of ice and uh, squeeze them together, like uh, two ice cubes, if we squeeze them together, they will basically melt and uh, stick to, to one another. So that process occurs by what we know as regulation. So, <clears throat> if you take a look at the movie, uh, which should be playing now, uh, you'll see some equipment set up where we've got a block of ice about this thick, about, uh, that, that square and about a centimetre thick. There's a, a loop of like, cheese wire wrapped around it and a mass, a bottle of water, glass bottle of water, uh, which probably weighs around about uh, 1.5 kilograms. And that's attached to the wire, so it's pulling down on the wire. And the wire basically cuts through the block of ice uh, on, e on either side. The pressure seems to be being applied at each end. Uh, and once, it's, once the wire's gone through, the water uh, refreezes in, its, in, the, in the track behind the wire. Um, so the, the block of ice actually remains intact. I've attempted to salvage th this, this one here. It's a bit dangerous, but uh, as you can see, hopefully, the, the wire is well and truly through, through the ice, it won't, it won't come back out again through the track, it's, 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 it's cut through, it's basically stuck. Um, so that's, that's how it ends up after about 30 minutes or so. And, uh, excuse me. So basically, that's the end result of, of, the, of, the, uh, ex of the demonstration. Um, we can analyse this a little bit closer uh, by guesstimating that our bottle of water, a 1.5 kilogram mass, would exert about 15 newtons of, of force, and we know that pressure uh, is the force divided by the area. Um, you know, as, so if you increase the force, you increase the pressure. If you increase the area, you decrease the pressure. So uh, the area for our block of ice, if we calculate it for the end, so it's about a one centimetre thick block of ice, and the, the wire was maybe one millimetre thick or less. So that's a total area on each end of 20 square millimetres, or two times 10 square millimetres. Um, in metres squared, that's about two times 10 to the minus five metres squared. So the pressure exerted is uh, 15 newtons divided by uh, two times 10 to the minus five metres squared, uh, giving us about 750,000 pascals of pressure. Um, which equates to about eight atmospheres of, of pressure. So in our little movie there, we're seeing a block of ice being cut through uh, with a wire uh, with a pressure of around about eight atmospheres. So um, I hope that's adequately explained. Uh, it's certainly demonstrated. And um, thanks for watching. Okay, bye.